Good morning everyone. Hope everyone's doing well and uh, today I am going to uh, preview a uh, an auction piece. Uh, Heritage Auctions of course is coming to a close for their A&A World's Fair of Money listings. One of which is this stunningly beautiful 1944S Washington Quarter. Uh, this one is graded out at NGC. Mint State 68, and as you can see, it has some pretty phenomenal looking toning on the obverse of the coin. And uh, this is a lesson. If you find a coin uh, which appears to be like an end of roll piece, and it doesn't matter what denomination, uh, toning will bring a serious premium to your coins. Uh, this particular item has just transitioned over to the live auction, the internet auction bidding part of it is officially closed as of about 20 minutes ago uh, this particular coin uh, obviously was an end of roll coin so it's part of a a um, a bu roll in its original wrapper at one point this was not an album piece or anything like that because of how clean the reverse of the coin is okay that's one of your um, telltale signs of a coin that was once in a roll and um it, you know, it, coins are very reactive, especially silver and copper. They're very reactive to the paper that surrounds it. So that's why we have extremely beautiful looking uh, colors on the obverse face of the coin. You know, I see, I can identify some yellow, some of that foresty green in there, uh, some orange, you know, kind of like a sunsetty uh, type of uh, pattern to it which I find it extremely attractive uh, as of right now the bidding is around 3200 and uh, the based off of the population reports I mean it is a nice lofty high grade with no distractions whatsoever and I can imagine in person the coin looks extremely lustrous even with the toning film on there uh, there are seven pieces in this grade that was graded through NGC. There is one finer at 68 plus and two others with, with a 68 star. So those also have pretty amazing toning as well to garner the star designation on them. Uh, if you guys are interested in uh, taking a look at this auction uh, for yourself on their website, it is ha.com. This is listing number 3583. Uh, again, currently it's at 3,200. I anticipate this one to finish somewhere in the five to six thousand dollar arena uh, by the time the hammer falls uh, later today. Uh, I would, you know, maybe five years ago this would have been a ten thousand dollar coin, but because of the additional pieces in the market, there is a couple finer grades. That's they keep this one at that price level. Uh, for a coin that traditionally out of the box you can pick up BU for about 30 40 bucks uh, so that, because of 44 s is not really a a low mintage in spite of the San Francisco mint mark it's not a low mintage coin by any means um, and they're very plentiful up to mint state 67 so uh, yeah I just wanted to review this coin uh, this is one that will be ending today it's part of the ANA World's Fair of Money Heritage Auctions is, of course, um, hosting this one. And uh, again, simply beautiful coin and a great lesson in originality and what you should look for in some of those older legacy collections that are passed down over the years. I want to thank you guys again. Do me a solid. Give me a great big like. Subscribe if you haven't done so. Again, it's Blue Ridge Silverhound. And uh, I throw up videos daily. So if you like coins, you like collecting, paper money, you name it, we talk about it. So thank you guys again and uh, have a great afternoon. Take care.